Welcome back, Pipers. Hopton Piper Kevin here, coming to you from the heartland of America in Missouri. And today I'm coming to you from Branson, Missouri. By the time I get this uploaded, I'll be back home, but this week is our spring break week, and we are at Stormy Point Village in Branson, Missouri, having a great time. And I thought while you smoked your pipe with me today, I could just show you some quick videos and pictures from this family trip. Well, we're in the middle of our spring break week. And we've had a really good time so far. We've seen some really good shows, eaten some really good food. The weather's turned a little cold though, so it doesn't really feel like spring. It's in the 40s here this morning. I brought this little Chacon Atlas Yellow 42 pipe as my travel pipe this week. <laughs> Also brought just that little black uh, basket pipe that I've had forever. Um, so those are the two pipes I'm traveling with. Been smoking Peace Haven since this is a special occasion. Brought some Peace Haven, been smoking that. And then this morning I think I'm gonna light up some Capstan Blue, so let me get this lit.
smoking capstan blue. It's like I brought an old friend along with me on this trip. <laughs> I would have brought some Orlet Golden Slice, but what I have open, I've already smoked. And I think the next tin I open of Orlet Golden Slice is gonna be a square tin, my last old square tin I have. And I'll show you that on one of the upcoming videos. But yeah, Capstan Blue, it's, it's a top five blend for me, probably. I love how you can get that earthiness, but you can also raise any character. There's sometimes a little bit floral. You can get a little tomato note out of this sometimes. That Virginia tea that I talk about. Capstan Blue is really good. The more time I spend with it, the more I continue loving it. <laughs> you can look in the description below of see if there's any of these you might be interested in listening to the reviews I've done. I, I, brought, I brought about four blends. I think I've reviewed three of them, so I'll put links to those in the description in case you missed them. Hobbits and Piper does not like haunted houses. This is a bad idea. Oh, Another cold morning in the 40s. It has not felt like spring very much on this spring break. But this morning I'm smoking Peter Heinrich's Dark Strong, one of my favorites. Yesterday was crazy. Went to a dinosaur museum where they had like life-size dinosaur statues to really give you the perspective of how big they were. And then we went to this retro mania. It's pretty new here in Branson. And it's got mostly all 80s stuff in it. There was a spook house in there though that had like classic slashers in it as you walk through and jump out and scare you. Mm. I'm not used to that. I don't do very well with spook houses, do you? <laughs> Woo! That scared me.
So it's been a little colder and a little more rainy than we were hoping for, but that's how it goes. I'm hoping Friday will be a better day in terms of weather. But it's Thursday right now, so it's probably going to be another indoor adventure somewhere. Maybe I'll take a video or two there. This is our little cottage. Been using that little balcony up there a lot. Back home, where I can finally relax from vacation. <laughs> I'm 
But I'm happy to be able to go places like that with the family because memories are important. Making memories with family is important. But I'm happy to be home. There's something special about just being home. And relaxing. <laughs> but if you don't get out there, then you don't ever get to experience things and do things. So I guess you need good balance. It was a good time. So you guys tell me what you're smoking, what you're smoking it in. I think I'm going to take a nap. <laughs> Until we talk again, go enjoy some good food, good drink, and a good pipe.